Hello everybody and welcome back to another official Towny tutorial with me Major Graft and we are here today in my town on the Shadow Kingdom server to talk to you about sharing your plots with friends. Yes this is actually one of the most uh, asked about features uh, on my other videos so I thought it was about time that we did a little video showing you how to build on plots uh, with more than one person uh, and it's really simple so let's get on with it. Just a quick note before we start folks, this uh, tutorial is specifically for residents in a town, not for town mayors. So if you're looking for help on a personal plot, you're in the right place. Uh, if you are a mayor looking for help uh, with uh, building your town with other people, then don't worry, there will be another video coming along uh, in the near future, uh, so hang on for that. So here I am, as you can see, on this plot that says uh, it is owned by me, Chief Major Graft. Uh, but I don't want to build on my own. I want to build with my friends. So there are two elements to this. One is adding a friend to your friend list. And then two, giving them the permissions to build on whatever plot you want. So let's go with the first one first. How do we, first of all, see our friends list? Well, it's very simple. There are a couple of ways of doing it. The simplest one is to do slash resident or slash res. And that brings up uh, this, uh, which shows us all the details about me, Major Graft. I own one plot uh, and I have three friends at the moment. Yay me. I have Infernals Rush, Sergeant Tiger and Ryan Rock 07. But I want to add another friend to my list. Uh, so, yes, of course, the other way of seeing your friends list uh, equally uh, uh, straightforward is slash res friend list. And that will show you very simply in the chat the, the, the list of friends that I have on my friends list. So how do we add someone to our friends list? Well, it's very simple. We're just going to go slash uh, resident or slash res friend add and then the name of the friend. So I'm going to add my good friend Luminicent uh, as a friend. And there we go. Added Luminicent to your friend list. And we can check that that's worked by running the slash res command again. And there it is. Now I've got four friends. There's Luminicent added to my list. So now then, we've added friends to our list. Now that's the first step. How do we add them, uh, give them the permissions to a plot? Uh, so let's take, for example, this plot. I don't want to build my base all on my own. I want Luminicent's help. So I'm going to give my friends the ability to do absolutely everything on this plot. So before we start, uh, we need to uh, do plot perm hood, uh, which will allow us to see what perms are on uh, the plot that we're on. And here, as you can see at the moment, nobody has any permissions on my plot. Uh, you can add uh, friends, uh, townsfolk, allies and outsiders uh, onto any plot. We're concerned today with friends. So uh, let's say I want Luminition to have permission to do absolutely anything on my plot. Well, it's really simple. So all we do is we do plot set perm friend on. And there we go. As you can see in the perm hood, we have now given our friends the ability to uh, build, destroy, uh, switch, and item use. All of the permissions they can have, uh, which is fantastic. Brilliant if you've got uh, people who are collaborating on a build together, allows them to place anything and change anything that they want. But uh, there are other ways of using your friend perms. For example, you might want people to be able to come into your buildings, open your doors, uh, hit switches and buttons and uh, those things, but you don't want them to be able to build or destroy your build and your base. So you could just simply give them the one-off uh, permission of uh, the switch permission. So let's just uh, take those perms off again. So this time we do plot set perm for end off. And there we go. Uh, they've got no permissions. Now we just want to add that one permission and we need to do plot set perm friend switch on and now as you can see uh, we have given uh, friends on our friends list the ability to switch which means they can uh, come through doors pull levers hit buttons all of those kind of things but they can't build and destroy and other things which is quite handy uh, and you can do any uh, permutation of these uh, you can give them the ability to build and switch or destroy and switch or just build and destroy anything that you like. It's really quite flexible. Uh, fantastic for doing collaborative work. And obviously you can do this on one plot or you can do it on all plots uh, that you own. Uh, if you change those commands from plot set perm to res set perm 
friend on. And what that will do then is give uh, them, uh, you give your friends permissions on every plot you own. Uh, that set your default uh, permissions on all of your plots so uh, that your friends can work on all of your plots, not just one specific. So it can be really flexible. If you own three or four plots and you only want them to be able to use one, then you can use the plot set perm. If you have uh, lots of plots and you want them to be able to use uh, build on all of them, then you can change the resident set perm command and that will automatically give them those uh, uh, abilities on all of the plots that you own. And of course there is one last thing now that we know how to add friends and allow them to uh, do things on our plots. Uh, what happens if we change our mind? What happens if uh, one person we have on our friend list we decide we no longer want to uh, have access to our plots uh, and be on the friend list? Well you can remove them very very simply uh, with slash res friend remove and then their name. So sorry Lumi but I'm afraid you're off. And there we go. We can see a uh, removed lumination from your friend list. And we can check that that's worked by running the slash uh, res command again. And there you go. You can see a uh, lumination is no longer one of my friends. And uh, that uh, means that they no longer have permission to work on this plot, even if the friend permissions are on in the permission hood. So there you have it, everybody, the quick demonstration of how to use the friends list feature in Townie and how to add friends to your plots. Uh, I hope you've uh, enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, please uh, consider uh, subscribing. Uh, the, the count's going up quick and we're nearly at 500 so your help is very much appreciated and as always if you have ideas for other tutorials that you think I should be doing please please do mention them in the comments below. I do read all the comments. I will reply to them and I definitely take them seriously uh, when I am planning what uh, tutorials to do next. So guys in the meantime happy building and we'll see you in the next one.